Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful Scorpio. How are you doing? This is your host Shivang. I welcome you all to my channel. If you are new to my channel, do like, share, and subscribe. And I hope you are liking the setup. And uh, Scorpio, I'm going to do your July reading uh, for the love energy. And this card just uh, flipped, you see. Uh, for the love energy so when i said love energy and i saw the sun card which is absolutely enlightening and uh, awakening illuminated you know something big is illuminated in this love dynamic of yours probably you have got some kind of understanding or probably the love interest of your life uh, however it works for you okay some kind of understanding after a tower moment okay that means something that did not serve in this connection has absolutely crumbled down all right and if you are coming into this reading today it's just that you are looking for a validation uh, possibly and every time you are experiencing a tower moment scorpio every now and then uh, in this connection when you feel that okay uh, it looks like that now everything is going to be fine, uh, you know, everything will fall in place, then bam, one tower. And you are like shocked. What happened? Everything was fine till yesterday, till just a um, uh, couple of hours back. Then what happened? You know, it's like something has been going on with you for the last uh, possibly, uh, let's say, 16 months, 16 weeks, you know, any which way or 7 months or 8 months, you really had to struggle a lot as far as your strength and courage is concerned, all right? Your faith, your trust has been shattered, devastated with this connection of yours, you know. Today when you are here in this reading, Let's see what the following cards come, Scorpio. Um, today when you came in this reading, it's like you even don't know why you are here. Let's put it this way. And this card just fell down. And this card says, your home is protected by angel. Uh, let me read this card to you. <clears throat> I'm sorry about the glare and focus okay archangel michael thank you for watching over my home and its inhabitants i ask that you post guardian angels at each window and door assuring its security thank you for guiding my finances so that i can easily afford to pay my rent mortgage or taxes what i feel with this card coming up here it's uh, yeah that's what i felt it was a kind of a journey since this connection came, uh, you know, as this I'm doing this love uh, reading. So what I feel is that this love connection has not only impacted the love energy that you have been uh, in, 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 in place for so long. It is actually has impacted your entire life in general. All right. Be it your family, ch children, you know, relatives, friends, colleagues. You know, this relationship, after this relationship entered your life, everything one after the other has got impacted in some way, shape or form. All right. Your finances got impacted. Your career profession got impacted. Lots, many tower moments has absolutely ripped you apart in a way that you felt like you were scattered in this universe, all right? You had no support, no help from anybody, okay? And if you have concerns about your family, your love interest, you know, anybody that you are associated with, your soul is calling out to them, then this uh, guardian angel present out here is saying that your home, your loved people, uh, your family members, everybody associated with you in this situation is absolutely uh, safe and protected, okay? You have nothing to fear, my dear beautiful Scorpios. You have nothing to fear. I'm really, really willing to see what this tower is all about because uh, this tower card is uh, and this card followed to that is uh, speaking out to me very loud. 
And when this tower comes, I'll tell you, you know, it's not only the tower that came on you and you crumbled down. It, uh, whenever an uh, earthquake comes, it, uh, apart from the epicenter, it impacts the entire area, possibly, right? Sometimes the entire nation, sometimes the neighboring countries as well. So that's the kind of an impact uh, that a tower can leave. But I feel that breakthrough is coming for you. I really, really strongly feel that break, breakthrough is coming for you, my dear beautiful Scorpios. Breakthrough is coming for you because you are absolutely done with this energy. You know, you are absolutely done with this energy. And I'm telling you, uh, you know, Scorpio, whenever this tower came, people ar uh, around you got impacted too, all right? Say, for an example, if something fell on you, you know, uh, that has a, uh, that put you into a karma when there were certain consequences which has uh, spread the people around you, you know, which has got transferred to people around you. All right. That's what I feel because, uh, you know, sometimes this energy can be self-destructive as well. Right. Yeah, I know I'm a Scorpio and <laughs> I'm a Scorpio son and I know. Uh, what happens when a Scorpio um, uh, go through the self-destructive uh, kind of a situation, right? Oh my goodness, look at that. I told you that you are going to get some kind of breakthrough and this card uh, came up. And on this card breakthrough, it's, it's more like a kind of tower card only, you can say, that brings a breakthrough result, all right, wow, that's a beautiful thing, all right, and the two other cards that we got is understanding and new vision, so we got four major arcanas, one, two, sorry, three major arcanas, one, two, three, so Scorpio, you have nothing to fear, my dear, you know, after the understanding that you have got, after that you have grown up you have evolved you have matured uh, during this process throughout this time something uh, major events after facing all those uh, you know understanding through those lessons you know finally you are getting that breakthrough you know in your life to get a new vision to so that you can charge ahead in your life and as i told you when tower happens it impacts the other person so let's say if you if the love interest of your life you both had some kind of fall apart it has impacted uh, the love interest of your life as well if they have brought that to you then you got impacted as well right so both of you has got impacted in some way shape or form and with this card what i feel is that in this love interest, uh, love dynamic of your life, you know, after this tower moment, as I told you in the beginning, and I saw the sun card, uh, you know, some kind of illumination uh, that has taken place, some understanding that has taken place, which has brought some breakthrough results, uh, some new visions, you know, new understanding, new possibilities, new horizons, you know, something new that has taken place. You may not be feeling it at this point in time. You may be feeling that everything is uh, just bs all right i don't believe that that's when when you just can't come to that point oh i don't believe anything all this is bs then that's when bam magic happens breakthrough comes all right because throughout this time god has been testing you right testing your patience testing your trust and faith in the divine in the universe because universe will never leave you universe always ha have your back that's the reason you know uh, you guys are divinely orchestrated and that's why you came you felt that connection you felt that spark and you wanted to build up a life together right but until unless you have that understanding until unless the old skin is shed off or until unless the debris from the past wounds pains sorrows you know um, challenges whatever debris has been carrying uh, uh, you, you both have been carrying it needs to get cleared removed right once it is done that's when the breakthrough comes the new enlightenment vision comes right that is where you both are right now i can tell you this that is where you both are right now um 
in this dynamic the way you are getting enlightenment understanding new visions and breakthroughs even they are also getting the same kind of uh, visions you know into their di into their life and they are understanding the bigger picture of ev uh, everything about this connection that's why this tower has a huge impact and this energy is for both of you all right in whatever uh, energy form you both are both of you are in this energy okay and you will be surprised to see these cards you see what i told you finally uh, a balance is is getting restored in this connection with the temperance card and with this uh, ace of one new passion new drive new zeal to start all over again is taking place in your life that's what i strongly strongly feel for you my dear Capricorn because up in the horizon you have this four of wands that means um, that means a stable life that's why we got this card right you have nothing to fear everything about the family dynamic everything about the people that you love your um, uh, your friends family any well-wisher who, whoever you care for in this family dynamic everything is getting protected by the universe by the angels around you finally with the new vision you are able to balance out certain things in your life so do the love interest of your life all right with the breakthrough finally a passion is uh, emerging you know finally uh, something ace right is emerging to take you to that apex to take you to the heights of this dynamic, you know, the bond that you felt strongly within, the sacrifices that you have gone through, the tests and turbulations that you have gone through, you know, that was all for this three cards up here, you know, to bring balance into your life, to bring passion back into your life, to ignite that uh, ultimate divine soul within you, you know, because this is your birthright, right? To get that ultimate peace, to get that ultimate wisdom, knowledge, ultimate relationship, you know, relationship that's, that, that you can say once in a lifetime kind of connection, right? You have struggled so much for this connection. So finally, this is what it is coming towards you. Total healing, total new vision, total new start, ace. It's all about ace because a new era is about to start in your life, period. That's what I feel because... This card is, you know, I'm choking. You know, I'm really choking, to be honest, <clears throat> with this card. What I feel is that, my dear beautiful Scorpios, you really, really have felt a lot of pain uh, since the time this connection has taken place in your life. That tree uh, grew in this connection. With time, as the, as the seed started to grow, it started to take the shape of a tree you had more challenges to face but always know this you know once the tree is full grown once the tree has taken the shape of a tree the way it should be right that's when the stability pa you know passion drive zeal balance new vision new understanding everything comes right that's where you both are right now seeing the higher picture of everything you are you are something that's why we that's why there is a saying that you know out of 12 zodiacs scorpio zodiac is one of the uh, zodiac that you know that can really outgrow any challenge in life they are the strongest of all Okay, and this card just uh, came out and this says prosperity, a prosperous business with riches and success. That's what I'm telling you. This tower finally has cleaned up all the past uh, garbage of your life and restoring you with new vision, new understanding, balance, passion, security, stability, breakthrough results for your life, which will bring a lot of prosperity all right you're going to have a beautiful family you'll have a beautiful married life with the love interest of your life where you will have a lot of passion drive zeal adventure you know you will cherish this relationship beyond age time space period absolutely you can you are going to this is such a clean and clear messages for scorpio to be honest and 
I am so happy uh, after this card came out because this card really, really choked me in a way. So I'm, I'm telling you, Scorpios, uh, <clears throat> your life is going to take another 360 degree turn. But this time, this is not going to be like kind of what the heck? No, 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 no. It's not going to be like that. Because whatever I told you in this reading and you have been in this dynamic say for the last one year or maybe 14 months or maybe uh, say 11 months or 7 years. However, I mean it's not a very recent connection that I'm talking about. So if you have been in this dynamic for long, then now you, you can really, really rest your case. You, it's your time to, you know, have some relaxation, some rejuvenation to retreat yourself after this experience. Because in the near future, you know, everything is going to be new for you. Because you are heading towards, a, you know, apex where you will have a lot of prosperity, name, fame, riches, uh, richness uh, for yourself, all right, in your kitty. And that will, that will take you to your soul people where you will feel protected, guided and secured, all right. Everything will be balanced out in your life and you will have the higher knowledge and wisdom with you all the time to guide you through this journey, all right. What I'm telling you, the viewers, right now, the same thing somewhere in this universe, the love interest of your life is having the same nudge because I always do these readings, you know, as per the download by the universe and I always set an intention with this reading, all right, because when we talk about love energy, there is not just one person, right, there are two person, it will have to be equally shared between the two person and love relationship is not just real love relationship you are here for ordinary sex uh, have eat it have fun party and go go back to source no it's not for that right a divine connection like this uh, is here for a bigger cause and bigger purpose and bigger mission all right which you together have to do it so it's always about two person so what i feel and i told you see it is always about two person and this Two person yeah, I am talking about. You may be of the same gender, all right. And with the third one out here uh, in human form, an angel form, that means this connection is absolutely uh, in charge of the divine. You see, divine is having an eye on this connection completely. No doubt about it. Divine has a complete eye on this connection. And you guys are absolutely on, on the right place at the right time as per the divine alignment. And you can you can see that. You can, you can validate that through the experiences that you have gone through in the last, as I told you, in the last 7 years, 11 years, 11 months, 10 months, however it works. You have experienced that, okay? No matter how much of differences you have, but at one point in time, you guys come in together. And I know Scorpios, oh, once Scorpio said that this is mine, then they will never leave it, right? <laughs> I know this. So, yeah. <coughs> because, <coughs> excuse me, you know, I'm sorry about that. Because Scorpios are always very intense, you know, when they give out themselves, you know, that's permanent in a way, right? And that's the beauty of this, uh, of the scorpions, that they are not like kind of feeble, you know, they are not uh, weak on their bones, their spines are straight and they, are, they know what they are doing, they know what they are saying, you know, they know when they come to speaking their truth, it is the ultimate truth, they will not play with words, you know, a true Scorpio I'm talking about, because Scorpio also has a dark side. All right. I'm talking about a Scorpio who is evolved. So if you are dealing with a Scorpio who is really, really, truly aligned, awakened and evolved, nothing can stop that kind of a Scorpio. They are powerful than anything. They didn't, they didn't become, uh, you know, one man army. All right. That's what I feel. And you see seven plus six is 13. 13 is the number of change. Okay. And uh, 13 is the number of Lord Shiva. It's, it's the 13 people say it's bad, but I see it as a very lucky number. And 3 plus, uh, 1 plus 3 is 4. And we got 4, 4. And 13, that's all about stability, right? This is 6 of cups, you see. And this card says, you treat me like your princess. So they are saying that you really, really have, you know, 
um, put them in in a way in a in a pedestal and as i told you scorpio that you strongly feel about this connection that this is written on stars and you know you just feel it like they are deep in your bones you feel that there is something you know about this connection and you know that you will never feel like that again and you are still like you know uh, in a praying mode you have surrendered to the universe and you are doing everything possible to enhance yourself all right because of this intensity all right but you cannot let go of this connection that's what i feel uh, and with the seven of clubs yeah i told you remember you cannot let go of this connection that's what you feel that means you are you are you are setting up your boundaries but you are standing by your truth all right you are guarding yourself you know you are guarding this connection and this card says you never let me feel lonely they are acknowledging that you are ne you never feel them lonely you know you are always there whenever they needed you okay you, whenever they needed you you have been always there with them all right uh, which they really really uh, is acknowledging right now that you have been always there with them uh, when they needed you you never felt make them feel lonely they always had somebody to look up to but in your case it was absolutely opposite that's what i feel for you scorpios all right and k and a and a is you see this is ace of cup right and you got ace of wands and i told you new beginning new horizon everything new a fresh start uh, is awaiting you after the end there is always a new beginning right so the seed that you have put uh, put in uh, you know that has already taken place you know has grown in a different dimension and you will see it in 3d in no time it may be in one day maybe in one week maybe in seven days uh, one week i told you you see i feel this energy is going to take place within a week time i had this strong nudge and i know because there are some planetary alignments at this point in time and you see this is king of wands right so king of wands coming towards you with the ace of cup that's so beautiful and this card says you are my strength and king of wands says you are dedicated in our relationship period <laughs> yes yes they see that they see that you are absolutely dedicated in this connection and you deserve to be appreciated you deserve to be loved you deserve to be respected uh, for whatever you have done all through this time all right it's your time now scorpio to get your rewards back whatever you have put out to the universe through this connection it's all coming back to you now it's all coming back to you now my dear beautiful scorpios you should be happy really really happy you know it's time for you to rejoice it's time for you to celebrate it's time for you can see the recently uh, that the the channel message universe channel message that i have posted you know you may have some messages for you there scorpios it's not the time to cry shed tears you know sit in a corner of your house and keep wandering keep thinking and keep uh, resurfacing those thoughts from the past and trying to connect the dots where what went wrong where i went wrong what different i could have done uh, how i can now fix this out what uh, better i can do now you know all this thought that you are carrying within it's time to let it go all right let it go and con uh, concentrate in your life or all right concentrate on your career your priorities in life what is meant to be meant to be and will follow you and i'm telling you the scorpio you can hear from your you you can get ready to hear from um, from you see i wanted to say this if you strongly feel this connection in your bones that this is it this is it kind of a connection that you have lived all through this time then i'm telling you this person is going to call you in a day in week time in 6 days 7 days one day however it works whenever you see this reading all right so what i feel for you is that my dear beautiful scorpios all the sacrifices that you have done all the hard work that you have put in all the tests and tribulations and challenges that you have gone through the pain and the sorrows that you have endured all through this time it is finally getting paid off 
through a divine gift from the universe in the shape of ace of cup and ace of uh, wands coming from the king of club the passion of your life that man with passion you know it's coming towards you because all through this time whether you have seen that or not my dear scorpios they have also has uh, you know um has fought for this connection you will be able to hear the entire truth of this dynamic which is yet not very clear to you but yes when this person comes back you will be able to hear a lot of truth nothing but the truth truth of this connection how they felt all through this time they are going to speak that out to you all right which will bring a lot of healing lots of understanding lots of clarity you know lots of uh, leftover debris will be cleaned out and you will be getting you will finally get ready uh, you know with your king of wands uh, holding that you know ace of wand and that ace of cup towards a new uh, earth all right and i feel that you guys are going to get married i truly feel that all right so i hope scorpio it resonated with you um please take whatever resonates for you and leave the rest all right until we meet again i'm sending across much love and light to you all om namah shivaya